basically with departure from the Black Scholes formula uh, into pricing corporate debt. So basically, the, the, the biggest research question is about whether structural models, uh, which are structures driven by the, the Black Scholes formula, which generate equity implied spreads, do they under or over predict credit risk? It's a very relevant question, especially nowadays when credit risk is every day in all newspapers. The, the real question about how to price properly credit risk, what is the fundamental credit risk of corporations, is totally critical for corporations. And that's about the research we are doing. We are at, at the edge on theoretically modeling, but simultaneously the contribution was very pragmatic, was specially uh, focused on practitioners. So that's also about the culture of Cranfield. Here we learn about research into action, doing pragmatic work using very powerful theoretically modeling techniques. What are the main um, uh, uh, the areas we have researched? Departing from testing structural models into price discovery, and price discovery tells us in a crisis, in a, in a, in a, in a dark Friday, when the markets they just plunge 20%, but they assume the equity market, the credit default swaps have corrections uh, as an increase about 10%, the bond market uh, has uh, different corrections. Which market tells us more efficiently about the real, the fundamental increase of trade risk? That's what we are studying. We are testing and our results show that counterintuitively the equity market is the most efficient market in price discovery. Why? We believe that it's most attributable because of the low transaction costs and because of uh, the, the high liquidity, which actually beats more sophisticated markets such as the credit default swap market. And then we move on to our third uh, area of research, which is capital structure arbitrage. What is it, capital structure arbitrage? Once again, research into action, using structural models as a powerful engine to price credit spreads. And every time we detect a large discrepancy between the observed credit spread of a certain firm and what our model tells us, we will trade. And we do an algorithm trading strategy and try to assess abnormal returns. Abnormal returns is excess return, uh, risk adjusted returns. So in this sense, once again, we go through a very analytical uh, methodology which is totally applied into practice. Most hedge funds have been using capital structure arbitrage since 2002. It has been reported as the most successful, one of the most successful trading strategies. And through our research we show that we are able to generate, to exploit credit for swap market inefficiencies and generate abnormal returns between 3 and 5% for different calibrations using implied volatility, using historical volatility, which once again shows that in some circumstances CDS market is inefficiency, uh, is, uh, CDS market is inefficient. So what I learned from this process and from the, the PhD on the top of growing in different domains of the literature is the ability to further research new, new areas and new avenues. What are the next steps? Our next steps, and, and, in, and here we learn that in academia uh, is about doing work with an impact. And doing work with impact means publishing. And that's why we used to say publish or perish. Doing a proper PhD without having publication in view is like dying when we arrive to a beach, in the sense that uh, we have already a revise and resubmit for a very good journal. We expect to submit to another a, a journal the, the third chapter of our thesis, and we have more two work, working papers in process. On the top of that, we have two papers in, in, in one of the leading conferences, which is um, in, in the United States in Atlanta, next October, at FMA, Financial Management Association. So our focus, and, and, and my understanding is, and how I feel is that the show has just begun and, and, and everything is now starting. Uh, the PhD is the, the, the starting point from a, for a whole life which, 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 which departs from this point.